Hello, I'm Nadia Devogorsky here at New Image College, and we are so excited this year to be sponsoring the Art World Expo. We have the chance today to interview Monica Blihar, which is the organizer of the Art World Expo, and the president of New Image College, Shari Van Dyke. How long has the Art Expo been going on for now? This will be the fourth year that we've put it together at Telus World of Science every year, and uh, we're really excited because we're getting closer and closer to our fifth anniversary, which will be really exciting. What? inspired you to start it all? I'm an artist myself and a couple years ago I started going to shows and started doing things out in the community as well and I thought oh I could do something really great and I thought of an idea to do some fundraising for other arts organizations in the city, Arts Umbrella um, and also Safe Water Nexus which was a charity for some rebuilding in Haiti after the earthquake and we put together two shows at the beginning and they were so great and since the second one at Science World went so well we just kept going with it and kept growing it every year and went from a show from the first one we did was 23 artists and now we have over 100 every year so it's just growing every year. Do you find it ever difficult to choose exactly from which applicants you're going to choose? No, actually, so usually we have lots of applications and most people we are able to accept because we do advertise pretty early. The only time we ever have to turn anybody really away is when they're just not ready to exhibit or to show um, at this platform because it is pretty high level platform. Being at Science World and being red carpet, we do have to keep it to a certain caliber. But we do try to be inclusive of all types of artists, emerging artists to professional artists, um, just to make it a show that's you know really encompassing everybody um, in the art world in Vancouver. What are your goals for the Art World Expo? Well first and foremost my goals are really to help the artists get exposure and get experience as working artists uh, in the city especially Vancouver which is the place where the show started. The second thing that I try to do is also to get artists trained in different areas so we do lots of training in terms of social media marketing, um, how to get your artwork out there, how to exhibit, how to set up a booth space, um, so we do all this kind of stuff in addition to um, just having your booth at the show. Also creating a really memorable experience for the guests. So we have all sorts of themes and all sorts of interactive displays and I encourage everybody to do um, not just be standing at their booth but also to do some interactive um, art demonstrations or live painting or things like that. Um, and then the third thing that I really try to focus on is really just creating an event that will be memorable and that will be um, all-encompassing for the community. So creating those opportunities for regular people who have no idea about any kind of art or any acting or special effects makeup or anything like that um, to really just come and enjoy and learn a little bit about what kinds of things happen in Vancouver in terms of art and culture. Did you ever expect it to be this big? and it's successful. You always have this this idea of a big vision in the back of your mind, but you never actually think that like, oh my God, wow, I am gonna, it is happening and it is unfolding the way that you kind of thought about it at the beginning. So I kind of had an inkling of, yes, maybe this is a good idea and it will grow, And uh, but I never expected to be working with these amazing people and at this level and humbled by it every day with the amazing talent that I get to work with and the stories that I get to hear from artists. So it's been more more than I ever imagined it would be. Why is New Image a part of the Art World Expo? Well, we were invited to become, I guess, a participant in the event because the Art World Expo is very similar to what we do and what we offer. So um, New Image has students that are involved in an airbrush program, a course that we teach, and the Art World Expo is an airbrush competition. So we thought it'd be a great opportunity to put the two and two together and be a part of this community event. So how else is New Image then involved with the whole experience of the Art World Expo? We actually sponsor three of our own students. We put on a competition and we ask the students to put together a package, an entrance package of their art ideas and what they thought would be great utilizing the circus idea, I guess, circus concept. and. Um, they put this together, we looked at it, and then we had Candace, who is our artistic director, choose three of our own students to actually compete. So we've sponsored three students in the event. We're doing um, demos and showing how the students learn prosthetics, basically from start to finish. So we have two of our graduates doing a demonstration on stage with a prosthetic. Then we actually have a display booth there as well, so we'll be demonstrating the different types of courses that the students learn and their skills which also helps the student when they're actually communicating. So 
When we do different events, we get students to come out, we get them to show the demos, we get them to communicate with an audience, which gives them the opportunity to network, meet people that are like-minded, as well as have an opportunity to be part of an event that they're already training for. Thank you for watching and I hope you enjoyed this clip. To get more clips and more information about our courses at New Image, you can see us at newimage.ca.